Hello, it's Tuesday, August the 31st, the last day of uh, August, and uh, we are in uh, the third servant song uh, in the 50th chapter of Isaiah. Yesterday we began to look at the kind of Messiah, the kind of servant uh, that God would send to deliver his people. And he describes him as one who is well taught, one who is learned, someone who is wise and able to minister, especially to the weary. And then in verse 5, the Lord God has opened my ear and I was not rebellious. I turned not backward. I gave, verse 6, my back to those who strike and my cheeks to those who pull out the beard. I hid not my face from disgrace and spitting. What kind of servant does God send? Someone who does not turn his back to persecution and strife and the hatred and animosity of this sinful world. He doesn't turn his back to it. He embraces it with both hands because he is, as the next servant song will make so abundantly clear, he is a suffering servant. He must undo what Adam did. He must pay the ransom price to set us free. He must be the propitiation to undergo the wrath of God and men on our behalf as our substitute, as our sin bearer. He must, in the words of the Westminster Confession in chapter 8, he must satisfy the demands of divine justice in order to save us, in order to procure our redemption. And for that, he must grasp with both hands the way of suffering. He must be crucified, dead and buried, as our sin bearer, as our substitute, and praise the Lord as our victor to set us free. Well, there's more and we'll look at it again tomorrow. Have a wonderful day.